Before I ever shot the stars, I spent a lot of time doing night photography around the city, around San Diego. I just had a fascination with doing long exposures at night. You know, it's, it's easier when there's absolutely no clouds and you can see the whole range of the galaxy and the stars. A lot of times, what is really great for astrophotography, at least where I live in California, is when the marine layer comes in, cuts out a lot of the light pollution from nearby cities, and it makes it super, you know, great to see the galaxy and the skies are really dark and really crisp and, you know, you can see all the little details. A lot of times after it rains, kind of just flushes everything out and, and clears out the skies. And, and uh, you know, that's kind of what I look for. I would say I try and capture things that are real, that are out there, that happen, that you can go and see, um, but maybe are less known, you know, like viewing the galaxy, being above a bank of fog, um, you know, an incredible sunset over an abandoned building. All these things actually happen. This is reality, but a lot of people might not get to see these things. And I try and just showcase, you know, things that, that really do exist. And I encourage people to go out and explore and, and try and find these things.